just in case I don't have a chance to do this with the other camera, I'm doing it with this one. So this is my, and you see I have my own entrance, my own staircase. Uh, this is my living room, this is the sort of kitchen space and a, a massive fridge which is much, much too big for me. Uh, that's where I'm doing my ironing. This is sort of like the dining table, kitchen table all rolled into one. Uh, I've got a sweet uh, sofa, uh, uh, armchair, television set. Um, this is the down here, this is the resort, the other side of that building is the swimming pool and all around the more, let's say the more expensive houses from uh, Trinidad, Port of Spain and uh, going through here there's a little hallway and then the bedroom, quite a sizable bedroom, storage, uh, little tables, a couple of night tables, big enough for a couple and uh, bathroom more than adequate um so you know i honestly can't say i'm uh dissatisfied with what's on offer but there are issues um you know it's in a it's in a difficult place uh, not necessarily convenient uh, and i don't understand the taxi system yet or the bus system because the taxis sort of act as buses um yeah there's that and the lack of you know facilities sort of next door but to be here, and I mean, you could be a couple here. Uh, I think uh, you can pay them to bring another bed, you know, if you've got a little kid or something like that. Yeah. I don't know if you can hear that, but there's a terrific row going on. Birds in the trees, mainly parrots, I think. Oh, they've stopped now, of course, because I'm recording. And I wonder if it's whether you see there's a tent in the middle of this green patch. I wonder if they're making food there and it's in expectation of being fed. Maybe, I don't know. So this is a Caribbean masala chai. A little bit different to a Dubai masala chai, right? And a Caribbean omelette. And uh, this is the place that I've just found. And it belongs actually, seems to belong to a, see, Christmas seems to belong to a um, fitness center and of course everybody's at work so nobody's here so i've got the cafe to myself this is a, this is a retail a retail a retail organization called coca bell uh, i walk past them because there's no sign anywhere saying re, uh, coca bell i don't know how to get in they say they're open i've been sending them emails there are four bells outside she said ring the bell which bell there are four bells I'm knocking on the door. I mean, it's almost as if they don't want to sell anything. Oh, I'm getting bloody annoyed by this, I tell you. Sorry, I lost it. Yes? <laughs> yeah, yeah. Our Felicity is another white chocolate ganache flavoring, but it's spiced with cardamom on the inside. We also have our festive rum and raisin bonbon, as well as our gingerbread spice, our Christmas caramel. Which is the Christmas caramel? That's this one here. It's similar to the mold of our salted caramel, but it's flavored with cinnamon. Yeah. And our honey and passion fruit flavored bonbons. Oh, wow. Uh huh. Uh, so these are bars of chocolate, are yeah. they? That's right. So we, all, we have five individual flavors. It's a mix of all the chocolate that we have to offer. So, like our Maliaba is a 65% dark chocolate with a slice of what we know locally as Gova cheese in the center. We have our mixture of milk chocolate and coffee, or coffee and cream bar, or Felicity is another milk chocolate bar that has cashews, coconut, and cardamom spices. And on the inside, we have our creme creole, which is one of our white chocolate bars with nibs. Inside, so texturally, it's the equivalent of a cookies and cream ice cream, but in the form of a chocolate bar. Mm -hmm. And like I mentioned, our 72% dark chocolate bar. Mm -hmm. I'm looking for some presents, and my constraint is the size of my bag. I've just got a little bag. Mm -hmm. So can you tell me what the, what am I looking at? variety of packet sizes. They also come in our nine piece specialty boxes and they have larger ones but I know you said your size of your bag is a bit small. We also have our box 
We have them packaged together in a mixed pack box as well as individually. Although if you are traveling, we suggest a box because it keeps the box from breaking. We also have our drafts. We have our cocoa beans and our hazelnut as well as our peels. So you're not, yeah, that's... So, um, sorry, what are the tins? Peels. They're peels. Uh -huh. cocoa, hazelnut and coffee beans just in six ounces. Yeah. Peels. We have our bars as well as our tea rings. Huh? And these are what's in the boxes, right? So these these are artisanal bonbons or truffles. They're all individually flavored. So I can run through the listing for you if you like. We have some sorbet bonbons. Sorbet bonbons. Yeah, dark chocolate and mint. Mint. Coconut cashew crunch. Yes. This is a wild thing, which is a mix of our banana and nuts infusion. We also have our golden milk, which is a honey, white chocolate, and turmeric mixture coated in that. Turmeric? Chocolate. Yeah, that's correct. Oh, wow. We also have our salted caramel, our punch de creme, sinfully dark, which is a play on our 72% bar. So it's a 65% dark chocolate coating covering a 72% dark chocolate ganache on the inside, hence, sinfully dark. So tonight I've come to a dangerous local place, no, criminally notorious, <laughs> I don't think. And I've decided to sit inside rather than outside, maybe outside would have been better but uh, 